our mission has always been to engage our culture with the irresistible love of Christ for the purpose of helping people take their first step toward Him. One of the ways that we do this is through outreach opportunities. As the church, we are committed to meeting the needs in our community. Eight years ago, we started a weekly food outreach out the back of a truck, just like the one sitting right here behind me. We may not have had much, but at The Journey, one of our core values has always been that we're gonna do the absolute best we can with what God has placed in our hands. Zechariah 4.10 says, do not despise the days of small beginnings because God delights whenever the work begins. So rather than waiting on an ideal situation to come about, our leadership decided that it was time to stop ignoring the needs in our community. We took what resources we had, we, we gathered willing people, and we got started. Fast forward to where we are today, and we see God took obedience with something small and has now provided us with an outreach center and a fleet of trucks to help meet the needs of people right here in our area. God is using the faithful commitment of people and the financial resources given through the journey to help make an impact right here in our community. Welcome to Making an Impact. I'm here today with our Outreach Director, Ron Steedley. Ron, great to have you with us. Glad to be here, thank you. So Ron, a lot of people may not know what goes into making our outreach happen each week and what it takes uh, to get all the food here. Where are some of the places that we partner with to get food each week? Sure, our primary partner is Feeding Northeast Florida, which is part of the Feeding American Network. We, we get deliveries from them. In addition, uh, we have uh, uh, a group of about 12 grocery stores in both uh, Nassau County and Duval County that we have a fleet of our own three trucks that we've been blessed with, uh, refrigerated uh, trucks, and uh, we run those trucks five days a week collecting groceries up from those, those 12 grocery stores uh, and brought back here for uh, sorting and, and staging and getting ready for the outreach on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So we run these trucks five days a week. So how many miles would you say we put on these trucks? Uh, we probably put probably 1,600 miles a week between the three of them running around the, oh, the two goodness. counties. Yes. So we go and get food from a lot of different places and it gets brought here as well. On a normal month, how, how much food comes through the doors? About 45 tons, 45 uh, yeah, about 90,000 pounds we're currently uh, uh, distributing uh, each week. And of that, every single pound goes right back out the doors into people in our community. Amen. So how many families come through the outreach center like on an average week? Uh, on the average week, we are, we are averaging about 650 families a week, which that rotates out to about uh, uh, 1,500 individuals a week that we are, we are uh, taking care of. 1,500 people. Yes, sir. So we do a lot to help meet the needs in our community. We, gosh, 1,600 miles in trucks, 45 tons worth of food, and 1,500 people every single week come through our doors but we have an actual worship experience we Amen. do every there every single week Amen. where we share the gospel with people so how many people have said yes to jesus just in the month of august ron there's been 15 folks that have come forward this month uh, and we've baptized several and we're going to baptize several more in, uh, in about a week yes that is so awesome god is doing a lot of amazing things in the outreach center and we just want to say thank you to you ashley and carrie and our whole team that helps make our outreach happen every single week 